Coas County Attorney John McCormick says Marianne Latart abused her position as town clerk and tax collector to steal nearly $150,000 from the people who elected her to the position in the town of Dummer. With fewer than 300 residents, that's about 500 per person. The town indicates that they stand by their original request for maximum restitution. But Latart's attorney turning to math to show it'd be difficult for his 57 year old client to pay back what she took if she served prison time, highlighting she would have to work day in and day out until she was in her mid 70s. That's again just a very aggressive schedule with virtually no wiggle room for anything that might happen, any potential health issues and assumes that she'd be able to find a job virtually immediately upon getting out of prison. Before making his decision, Judge Lawrence McLeod described Latart as somewhat of a model citizen with just a speeding ticket on her criminal record, someone who seemed to be well respected in her community. But he also said she was a trusted public servant who breached that trust. And there's obviously some significant collateral damage to the town itself. And to, the, and to the public. I mean, the town's a subdivision of the state. Something that weighed heavily in McLeod's decision to sentence Latart to serve four to 14 years in state prison. Latart gave one last look to her family before she left the courtroom in handcuffs. And Latart will also have to pay restitution to the town of Dummer. She can appeal this sentence if she chooses. We're live here in North Haverhill tonight. I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.